All right, so we're moving right into triceps here. I think that's the move. Triceps for a few different things, and then we'll hop in with biceps. Um, just because, why not? We have plenty of time today, so I could actually end with abs as well. So I'll think about it. So we got 80 on the stack here. <clears throat> Move down to 95, just like that. Um, yeah, honestly, I could I could probably chop this up into two videos, and I might. I don't know yet, but it's doable. Or else it's gonna be a pretty long video, which is I, you know, I'm cool with it. I just don't know if you guys would be. So we'll see. We got 95 on the stack. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, I got to take a breather, but so far that feels pretty damn good. So we're sticking with 95, 95 pound. Good shit. All right, another pause. We'll get one last set, and then uh, we'll actually stick with triceps. I'll do another tricep after this. Why not? Do like three movements triceps, three movements biceps. It should work. Triceps. Back at it. <clears throat> <laughs> yeah, that's that's good. That's a good start. So we'll go back into tricep dips and we'll stick with the theme. Triceps, boy. All right, let me pause this shit. All right, back to the tricep dip machine. This old hoist thing. This old thing. All right. Um. Yeah, we'll go. We'll go close grip. I like that. And we could say 145. All right. <sighs> Fantastic. Um, we'll increase this to 165. Take a breather. Shoot for like 10 more. That felt pretty damn good. All right. So we increased the weight here to 165. We got close grip. We'll see what happens here. <laughs> Yeah. 
Yeah, barely got 10 on that. So we're gonna stick with it and barely get eight in about a minute. All right, this will be the final set of this shit. Um, again, stuck with 165. Got close grip on the handles. Yeah, that is it for that. Um, I'm gonna do one more tricep movement, probably tricep pushdowns to be honest, just cause that's the icing on the cake. And then we'll do the bicep focused movements. Um, yeah, brother, I think that's the move. Okay. All right, tricep ribs it is. I pinched my finger in the fucking tripod. Totally ruined my day. Nah, I'm just kidding. It's not that. I just have a real gnarly blood blister, though. It doesn't really matter. But I don't know what it is. With whatever this angle is, I'm not. I don't know shit about physics, but this is always heavier than any other pulley machine. I don't know. I guess it's just these two angles and the way they interact with each other. Um, but we have. 40 pounds on the stack. We're just trying to go for clean, controlled reps. Okay, set one, complete. All right, set number two. It's only 40 pounds, this shit feels so heavy. All right, final set of this crapola. And then I gotta figure out what machine is available for biceps. We will start with warm up weights and then maybe go to heavier and then focus more on high rep squeezing. So that's my plan. Hey, what's up, Abby? All right, I gotta wipe this down and then, like I said, hop on a bicep machine. Get a nice warm up pump. Oh, uh, we're filming. I didn't even realize. So, no more break for me. All right, 125 on the hoist bicep machine. Okay, this will feel marvelous. go up to 145, squeeze out another 10 plus reps. Damn, somebody's moving. They're running along the, uh, the turf area. 
and goddamn, they're moving fast. I'm jealous. I could fucking hop that fast. You watch. All right. 145. Curling it up. Curling.
so that was 145. I feel a goddamn burn from that. All right, 125 on the stack. We're gonna go till failure. That, I guess that's what you do on your last set. You go till failure. I don't know. I got a lot more, a few more. I wouldn't say a lot, but a few more movements ahead. So hopefully this doesn't burn me out. And if it does, so what? So what? All right. Yeah, that was it. It was fucking 10. That was all I had. All right. Next thing I do is probably going to be some sort of hammer curl. I don't know if we're going to be using cables or machine. I got to see what's available. But either way, I mean, this is a this machine gives you a wicked arm pump. Let me tell you. That was just two movements there. Palms down, palms up. It'll get you every time, trust me. All right, so we can do hammers on this machine actually, and it'll probably feel much better than what I was going to do. I was going to incorporate the rope, but then I got to lay down on the floor and it's weird. So we'll, we'll see how this feels. I'll do 50 pound and uh, we'll hit these. <sighs> Eight pounds or eight reps for 50 pounds. I think I honestly need to do 40. That's heavy as shit. We're going to do 40. Yeah, we're going to do 40. I'm going to drop this weight down. Or actually, we'll just do drop sets. What the hell am I talking about? Oh, I don't know why my right arm is so much weaker than my left right now. That makes no sense. Forty again. Forty again. That's a what? That's a thirty second pause now. I'm gonna drop this to 65 and then we'll do both arms hammer. Just give me a minute. I need to breathe. All right, lads. This will be 80 pounds, two hand hammer grip. It's like, that's such an underrated position on this machine and I really wish the grip went all the way up the handle, but it doesn't. Uh, so. It's on you. If it gets a little slippery, dry your hands off.
<laughs> all right, that was 12. Yeah, it's crazy, man. I, I really can't wait till this second surgery. That's like all I'm thinking about. I just can't wait to walk again. It's gonna be, it's gonna be the bee's knees, bottom line. That'll be the bee's knees, and I'm, I'm pumped. I'm very excited. All right, 80 pounds felt pretty good, so we'll drop it to 85. We'll throw a little helper weight on there, and uh, we'll do one more set, and then pass this machine to someone else. Here we go. 80 pounds, well, 85. Hammer, two hands. You know the drill. <clears throat> Okay. Um Yeah. We'll call it with that. I'm going to find something else. Actually, fuck it. We'll do we'll do one more set. I don't know why. Something's telling me to do one more set. I regret nothing. That was great. Even though it was only six reps, I felt like we were doing some ripping and tearing. In a good way, not a bad way. All right, I'm gonna wipe this down and then I'm gonna figure out what the hell we're doing next because I never know, that's why. All right, so these are those uh, flat bar curls. So we got 100 pounds in the stack and we're just shooting for reps and squeezing. <clears throat> okay, I like that. I think we will go to one twenty. And I'm gonna get a little different angle because I would prefer my foot to be flat on this post here instead of at an angle like I was doing before. Oh uh, no, you guys are good. Never mind, I'm gonna go back this way. Okay, pause it. All right, 120 should feel pretty damn heavy, but we'll see. Hopefully, no one steps on my face. That'd be a plus. Oh, son of a biscuit. All right, 120 fell heavy as shit, just like I thought. So we're going to leave it at that, and we'll get one more set, maybe two. All right, so I guess I guess this will be the final set of this. We got 120 on the stack. Straight bar curls, bitches. All right. <sighs> Yeah, that was all right. That was all right. I'm gonna find, I'm gonna find another bicep machine and roll with that, I think, and do like isolation curls.
I don't know why, but that's what I want to do. So that's what I'm going to find. Okay. You got the 45 pound plates on here. Um, I was thinking of doing like isolated, but whatever. This feels pretty good too. So let's we'll see. So, we'll take a breather on that, on that note. I kind of, I kind of lost the pump a bit, but we're going to get it back. So, let me get a, a little breather here. Uh, here we go again. And, uh. This will probably be the last movement, to be honest. I'm kind of tired. I think I'll go home now. As a Forrest Gump reference. What you know about it? All right, so we're gonna shoot for reps. <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> Slow, controlled negative. <clears throat> yeah. Okay. We'll get one more set. And then uh, I might do abs, might not. I don't know. I'm probably not going to record it because I think I probably already have quite a bit of footage for today's video. But, you know, we'll just call this the Thanksgiving special. Why not? All right. All right. Final set here. Dude, I got a new appreciation Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm telling you. Yeah, that's a pain in the ass. Yep. <laughs> yeah, it's it's taken six years to get used to, I guess. You want me to leave the weight on? All right, cool. I'm in between surgeries at the moment. Yeah, so once once I get this next one done in December, I'll be walking again probably by January, February. I can't wait. I literally can't wait. I had my hip replaced a month and a half Damn, you're already back in here though. Oh god, I lost ten pounds muscle. No shit. No way. Got a UGI from the catheter. Fuck. And then they put me on Cipro. I've never uh, heard of that. What's Cipro? It's a really strong antibiotic. Oh. And it made me sick as hell. Really? And then I started losing water. So, I mean, I. So I, you're like getting dehydrated and shit. At, at, at 230, right? Yeah. I came out last week at 219. What? And I'm like, oh my God, I lost so much Yeah, you're fucking dropping pounds. Out. It'll come back fast. Yeah, it's just, it's frustrating though. And then it you come in here, you feel more weak and you're, you know. Well, I, ex I expected all that. Yeah, exactly. Know? I mean, I did too, but I, I hated it. I was benching like, I had a max of like 265. Were you a Christianity? No, I wasn't. Why? Uh, no, I was okay. at Anytime Fitness. I'm, okay. I still have a membership there too. But um, yeah, I know there's another amputee that's been floating around back and forth, I think. I see him. I, yeah. I thought it was you. Oh, no way. Yeah, because that's what some people have told me. And I'm like, I can't wait to meet the dude. Yeah. And he gets around as well as he does. Great. I dude I love to see it. I'm telling you. 
I wish more people would, would come in the gym and knowing that, you know, it's I, just I, challenging. You got to do it. Yeah. You know why? Because yeah. they don't and they end up losing a lot of muscle mass. Yep. Because if I if I had been in good shape, yeah, I wouldn't be able to lift myself out of chairs or anything else. Good point. Yeah, and you're almost useless, and then yeah. you're relying on other people, and that sucks too. And I mean, even, even getting in the chair, I had to use my full triceps. Yeah, yeah, and if you don't have that, you're but dropping in. How are other people doing this? Damn, my pops about to get his shoulder replaced. So I heard I've been, I've been lifting for oh my god, thirty years. Now. Yeah, those shoulders are gone. I've torn. Three muscles in, the, in my rear end. Yeah. I ripped my triceps off my arm. Jesus Christ, man. I've got five hernias. <laughs> that, that, that old saying, no pain, no gain. Yeah. No shit. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, love to hear it. I love to hear that shit. What's your name? Dominic. Dominic. Nikki. How you Nikki. Doing? Nice See to meet around, you, man. man. All right. You have a good rest of your workout. Let me know. All right. I appreciate that. Thank you. All right, man. Have a good one. You need a shirt. After that conversation with Nikki, brother. I can't end that there. That was badass, man. That guy's got 30 years of lifting under his belt. And he's got endless, endless injuries to talk about. He just had his hip replaced, I believe he said, a month ago. So he's in here on a cane. He said he lost like um, nearly 15 pounds of muscle just from, you know, getting stuck in the hospital, you know, on bed rest. And you'll have that. I mean, prior to my surgeries, I was... At my most, I was like 195, you know, trying to be big. When I was just fat, my most was 230. But muscular, my most was 195. And, you know, when I uh, got back on the scale after my surgeries and saw that I was 165, you know, it's a little depressing, but we get it back. We get it back. Just don't stop. So right now I'm just doing some forearm curls. Just because why not? It feels good. I'll probably end on this. Um, I'll end on this for arms, and then I'm going to go over and do a little bit of abdominals, but I'll go ahead and end the video there, because I'm probably going to be here for like another 45 minutes, and I don't want to make this video over an hour. It seems like it already might be, but either way, have a great Thanksgiving, guys. I might be back in here tomorrow morning making a little, a little video. We'll see, and if you watch the whole way through, I freaking love you. Oh, all right. Adios, guys. Have a good Thanksgiving. Love y'all.